Well, they pulled him out of the lake, but asked me after the autopsy. Time of death. There's early rigor, but uh, the water is very cold. It's difficult to tell. Ask, Ask me, me after, after the, the autopsy. autopsy. Where did you find him? In the water, just behind the rock. Nice start for a Sunday. Hi, Hitler. Greater Reich Tourism welcomes you to Tempelhof International Airport. I am Helga Schroeder, your guide. On behalf of the Ministry of Culture and Education, I would like to welcome you, journalists from the Americas, to Berlin, capital of the Greater German Reich. We hope you will have a pleasant stay with us. I used to cover Berlin for CBS before the war. I never thought I'd ever get back. A city of culture, where past and Neither did I. Side by side. Rush tourism will handle any and all of your needs while you are here. You've and been here before? I was born here. I left when I was little. My mother was German. She met my father before the war. McGuire. I know a Paul McGuire here, diplomat. He was my father. You are the first You're Americans kidding. to visit us since the war ended. Germania is a I'm Walter Elliott, CBS. I know who you are. We see no reason Germany why the stars and stripes the United should not fly in side peace by side and side It is the wish of the Fuhrer that relations between our countries should prosper and develop. We have nothing to hide and have many achievements we wish to share with you. Please do not lose your press accreditation. Without it, you will not be admitted to the many press functions that have been arranged for your benefit. So please, if you need anything, do not be afraid to ask. Guided tours of the city are available to our guests. We recommend you visit the Victory Arch and the Albert Speer exhibition during your stay. The war ended a long time ago. We are asking that you us the chance to show you how sincere we are in wanting to bring the Cold War to a close too. Isn't that what everybody wants? Sick again? Yes, I sat up all night with him. Coffee. Mm -hmm. Thanks. Yeah. Oh, nothing serious at all. No, no, nothing serious. Not really. Two espressos, please. Next time you need to sleep in, count on me. Another busy day in the sexual crimes unit. Who would love that? Your Aryan woman under Polak got right in the act. Coffee, please. Uh -huh. A resettlement state for her, ten years hard labor for him. I just don't understand these people. Hey. Every time somebody makes love, somebody else writes a report. Um, yeah, that's right. Here you are. Have some sugar. Yes. Hey, Zavi, I've got something in there for everybody. Anytime you are looking for something out of the ordinary, you let me know. Excuse me. Here, I'll capture the moment for you. Great. You will need a permit for the camera, Mr. Elliot. Oh. I can arrange it for you, if you like, through Rice Tourism. All developing and prints are free. Fine, thanks. This, I think. No, I don't think so. I 
think you did. There was a lot of water in the lungs which were swollen, balloon-like, and a watery, foaming fluid came out when pressed, so he could have drowned. But he has also suffered a massive coronary. Hard to say which came first. Extensive bruising on the upper part of the body. Bruising? He must have struggled to get out of the water. Probably in the water.